This video is just a short extract from the entire course. If you wish to see all of the videos from this series at higher quality and in far larger screen size, head over to ifskills.com. As we go through our design, there are going to be instances where we want to run pipes that are running parallel to others. There's a new tool in Revit MEP 2012 that allows us to do this. On the Home tab, it's called Parallel Pipes. For this exercise, I'm going to create a 3D view so we can better see how this tool works. First of all, I'm going to create a section. Let's take a look at the section and just review where it is. I have my section called section nine. So let's go to a 3D view. And right clicking on the view cube, I'm going to orient to a view, orient to a section, which is section nine. This orientates my view to match the section, which I can then spin around in order to see our exercise more clearly. Also in here, I'm going to hide my section box and temporarily hide the architecture. I'm going to tile my views so we can see what happens when we use the parallel pipe tool. I'm going to specify a horizontal number, a vertical number, a horizontal offset, and a vertical offset. As I hover over one of the pipes in plan, you can see that it's giving me a dotted blue line indicating where my pipes will go. And do the same for the vertical run. I will have to come into here and tidy this up. I can do this in plan from the Modify tab and using the Trim tool. To carry on using the Trim tool, I'll swap to the 3D view. Maybe turn line weights off, and I can carry on with the task of trimming the pipes. As you can see, this is a fairly simple exercise and we can even use grips to achieve the same result.